Let's see how we can make sending email simple and affordable with Send Simple app. So first thing first, you have to install the add-on. Once you have installed the add-on, you have to click on the add-ons, click on Send Simple, click Open Send Simple app. Once open, you will have multiple options here. Let's start with sender's name. So you can define what is the name the other person, the receiver is going to see. Then you can uh, choose your SMTP client. We have Gmail option as well as Amazon, SendGrid, and we are already working on Send in Blue. If you have any other SMTP which you want to include or you want to use, let us know by using the click to contact widget on our website. Now, let's see how this works and how we can send an email. So first thing you can see, I have this uh, these emails on my Google Sheet. I have name of them. I have the address as well. Now, what I want to do is I want to send personalized email to all these people with their name and address. You can use as many uh, personalized fields as you want. I'm going to open up the app and then I will define my name. What do I want to call myself? So let's say I will call myself Sanskar from Flutter Meetup. So that's just the email which I'm using. So that's why I'm using similar to that. Whatever you want to call, that's your business name. Or you can define it, hold your business name, however you want. To, uh, you want. Now I'm going to choose Gmail first, then I'm going to choose the template. Now what is template actually? Template is a email which you are going to send. So if you want to send a new um, email, just create a new template. I'm going to say hello. And then we can say something like we can use the personalized name. For example, I'm going to choose the name and then I'm going to say, how are you? And then I can define, we created send simple to make sending mail simple for you. Now I'm going to make some mistake, but uh, I hope you don't mind. Now, this is a simple template. You can include uh, personalized stuff over here. So I can add emails, um, I can add address, I can even add name. So basically how this works is whatever the header of that particular column is, just use that with these brackets, right? As, as explained over here. Now you can write it as long as you want. You can include images, you can set the color of the text, you can even use the developer mode to write HTML um, emails as well. And uh, then you can just click on save template. Once you have saved the template, then you can just select that. So for example, this is the one which we created right now. I'm going to choose that. And then I can just click on send three emails. Once I will do that, it will load for a second and it will send all those emails. Now you can click on this button to see all of the those emails sent. Uh, on your Google Gmail inbox, right? So it will open up the inbox for you. Now let's see how the other works. So for example, this is Amazon SES. One of the reason which uh, why Amazon SES is quite popular is because they offer 60,000 emails per month for free. So if you use that, let's use that and I'm going to use the sender name and you can use that and send three emails. You can also schedule them. So for example, I want to schedule this for today, but a little bit later, maybe two minutes from now. And I'm going to select that thread. Now, the reason why you might not uh, use uh, other SMTP than using Gmail is because Gmail is not made for marketing, right? So if you send more emails in a very short period of time, it will really affect and can even ban or uh, like your account. So usually it's not recommended to go with uh, marketing using Gmail. Um, use any of this SMTP provider. They will You will have no limits on how many emails you can send. They will take care of that. Now let's see how we can add these, right? <laughs> we have Amazon account, but how did I add that? Well, you can just click on settings and then you can click on add account. We have two options right now, Amazon SES and SendGrid. You can add as many account as you want. You can add multiple Amazon SES account. You can add multiple SendGrid account. We don't care. It's your application and we want to make it um, best for you. So for SendGrid, you just have to enter a name and then you have to enter the API key and mail from. You can get the uh, API key from SendGrid if you need some documentation on that. We have that. So check the footer of our uh, website. Now, once you have done that, let me just cancel and go back. Let's see how the Amazon will work. So same same thing. Uh, we can just choose the time and we can say schedule three emails. Once I will click on that, we will see these campaigns page. So you can see I have this campaign now, uh, which I just edited, right? It will be sent. And I think we can add some time over here as well when this will be sent. But I have scheduled this for after two minutes. So that's when this will be sent automatically. I don't have to handle anything. I can just close this and go relax, sleep, whatever I want to do. And the mail will be sent at that particular time. So if you like Send Simple app and want to give it a try, go grab a license. We have a 30 days 
easy refund policy no question asked so just go ahead give it a try if you like it keep it if you don't just refund it you will get your 100 percent back so yeah looking forward to hear your uh, feedback on this and let's make uh, sending mail simple and affordable using sendsimple